About time you showed up. We've been waiting for you. Our mission is simple. Sir Augustine will board the ox cart, and we must safeguard it from would-be assailants till it reaches its destination. See to it that none approach. The Queen Regent's supporters will come for Sir Augustine's head. Of this, we can be certain. Oh, a quiet day is a welcome one. Come along now. What was that sound? Who's there? Hold a moment. I'll be handling Augustine's escort from here. Foul brigand! We shan't allow Sir Augustine to fall prey to the likes of you! There's no need for theatrics. I know your aim here. Ah, here's a surprise. We met at the tavern, remember? Fair warning, cuz. This craven isn't worthy of your trust. He speaks madness. Subdue him at once, ere he injures our noble charge. Why, if it isn't Sir Ragnar in the tavern, now two parties ask him. Which of you would betray me? <laughs> Have you lost all sense? You believe me, then? That's a bit of a relief, actually. Thanks, cuz. Let my magics grant you an elemental boon. Curse you! All oh, that planning and... For what? Phew! I appreciate the confidence, cuz. It was a welcome surprise. But I can't linger here, I'm afraid. My apologies for this. Follow after me if you can. Succeed, and I'll share the truth of all of this. The decision is yours, Rick. I trust in your judgment. I believe I know whom we must seek. I believe I can guide you to the person in question. Trounced our foes. Arrange the trackers. They are the foes we ought to fell first if we can. By your leave. Have my protection. Once, Master. Arisen, I know of at least one location in the vicinity that may be of interest to you. Shall I tell you more?
Ahoy there. I take it you lost your footing as well? You seem to have fared better than I did. I took the fall for Augustine, only to find myself waist-deep in monsters. Still, so long as he escaped, I'd wager that makes this a job well done. Speaking of, I was to tell you the truth behind all of this, wasn't I? I'll be glad to oblige you, of course, but we ought to get moving first. What say I explain while we search for an exit? Time to get to work. Bad. From what I've seen of your skills during that mess in the tavern and today's business, I can say you're really something. And my word ought to carry a fair bit of weight, considering my reputation as a warrior of unparalleled skill. Turns out, as a sellsword proves himself, the list of those who can afford his services grows shorter and comes to be written in finer ink. Makes for a duller life, though I can't say I've any complaints about the weight of my pockets. <laughs> Still, I hunger for a real battlefield, where a single misstep spells death. I crave the simplicity of it. There's naught else like it. The clashing of bodies and wills. I'd not say no to a fight with you. Let's have at it when I'm all healed up, eh? <laughs> Mayhap, I'll not give you a choice in the matter. <sighs> I'm not sure what's brought me here. I suppose I'll have a few drinks and hit the hay. That escort mission was a trap concocted entirely for your benefit, you know. It was supposed to give those responsible a means to incriminate you. But Augustine is no fool. He had his doubts about his summons to Vermin and hired me to watch over him in an unofficial capacity. So I looked into the cart that would be escorting him and lo and behold, I found your name, but wasn't on the list of hired guards, oh no. Rather, your name was on the list of persons to be on guard for. In short, you had been called in to act the part of the culprit. Mark my words, if you'd carried on with them, Augustine would have been slain and you would have been held responsible. You'd not have stood a chance against all that if it hadn't been for me. I, methinks I've earned my pay this time, and then some. I protected my charge and got you away from the scene without your being branded a murderer and thrown in jail. Now all that remains is to escape this place. I expect we'll find a way out soon enough, if we only press on. Still, I've got to wonder where this craven plot came from, and what you did to warrant it. One thing's for certain, you must have powerful enemies in Vermin. But why? Tis not as though you're the arisen true. What? You are the arisen? Ha! <laughs> Tis a small world indeed. You've piqued my interest even further, cuz. I've no business here. Best I hit the road. Right. 
Let's press on. Judging from the flow of air here, the exit can't be far. Well, this is a right awful place to be cut short. At least you made it out all right. Don't worry, cuz. I'll be fine on my own. After all, I can't afford to die here. We haven't had ourselves a real bout yet. We'll see each other again. You can count on that. And when we do, you'd best be ready for the fight of your life. <laughs>